Good evening, Rainbow Brew. Rainbow Crew, how are ya? It's Paul. I haven't been around for a week or two. It's been very busy around here making hay while the sun shines and getting the best gardening done for my clients, putting in those plants that they were wanting that were the most tropical and I had a bit of an issue securing because of uh, most of them coming from Hawaii, Thailand, Philippines and, and Puerto Rico, but they're, they arrived and they're in, they're happy and uh, that makes me happy because we get a chance to um, enjoy the fruits of our labor. <laughs> Labor Day and this month of September I kind of slow down Brad and I will be being a little more hedonistic scheduling time for for spa treatments and repairing some of our our frayed nerves from uh, working so hard for these last nine months and giving us a much needed break uh, we have some more things coming up in the fall which will be treats too but for now as we wade through the tropical storm season we of course are here in Florida saying Irma go away but we're we're due to get another storm the last one was was 12 years ago and we're supposed to get one every eight or nine years so we're kind of lucky about that but the trees have gotten very lush and very heavy so any any wind that's any of any substance whatsoever probably will 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 nail us I've got a good crew of of waiting in the wings, uh, tree cutters and, and, and landscapers ready to help us out. All we need is a good check from the insurance company so we can pay for our la landscaping. Anyway, but no, things have been going good. We've been really enjoying. Brad had a fantastic month in, in his company, Spirit Title, and uh, the number one title insurance company in Broward County, Florida. Yeah. Um, and I've had a, a really good month too, just doing some of my my most uh, important clients and, um, and really kind of basing it more just on rapport and, and the relationships that we've had and you know not so much asking as I'm giving back so some some of my clients have been with me for 15 years now and it makes it you know makes me want to say thank you so I do a little bit extra for them at this time of year that no charge a little bit of extra tree pruning perhaps or um, just making some adjustments to soil that needs to be done so that the fruiting trees and the flowering trees will be happiest and look really good when the tourist season starts in, in a couple of months so anyway getting ready for <laughs> roll tide indeed yes we have our um, our first big college football game of the season number one ranked Alabama Crimson Tide versus the FSU miserable Seminoles with their tomahawk chop well, tide will roll. We know that. It should be a good game tonight. If you get this uh, message, uh, watching this video right now, you might catch a little bit of it tonight, the Saturday evening that it's being broadcast. This is what the the second of September. Enjoy if you do get a chance. The, the second half is always the best anyway, so don't worry about missing the the histrionics of the first quarter or so. There's, everything's won or lost in the last five minutes of a typical Bama game, so enjoy. And it's in Alabama, it's in Tuscaloosa. Weather should be beautiful and uh, the usual 103,000 faithful and the six million dollar band of Alabama will be there entertaining the people and Breasts will be jiggling and jock straps will be singling and it'll be, it'll be a good evening for men and women. Enjoy. Anyway, um, yeah, we're getting we're getting ideas for uh, you know for the fall. Um, probably we'll be getting a little more active now in our gardening areas because I really didn't want to be sweating as I was talking to you out in out in the hot garden. Uh, you know, for us, it's, it's certainly not a novelty to deal with the weather that we have here, but it's just no fun to talk to you when, when it's, you know, 96 and, and, and uh, humidity making you feel 115. So uh, I know you Phoenix people know what that's all about, but I'm not quite as brave as, as uh, our vegan athlete, and, and I don't really show my, <laughs> show my best image and, and give the best amount of energy for the topics that I'm talking about. 
Um, but we have planted a lot of things that are, again, truly tropical, that are coming from, uh, from the Southeast Asia and from Hawaii that I haven't been able to secure till now. And uh, I think they, I've seen them on Seamus's uh, segments and uh, um, uh, Jake or, or Brandon's segments from Arizona because frankly uh, they are truly tropical and they probably would only do well from here, uh, southern Broward County down to the Keys and into of course Cuba and Puerto Rico and Hawaii. So we're proud about that. I'm looking forward to it. It's the one good thing about climate change in the short term for South Florida is that we are zone 11 now and uh, we don't get as cold as we used to and that's kind of nice for us who want to experiment with something really special that you haven't seen here. I love mangoes too but I also like breadfruit, I like uh, uh, jackfruit and I like them to be thriving, you know, not just hanging on here and it looks like we've got that kind of stuff going well. Um, at any rate, that's, that's what, uh, you know, what we look forward to in the upcoming months. Before I go, because the game is starting pretty soon, I want to share with you some of the, the new finds that I've been uh, able to secure via sources. Remember we were talking about find a ring for Paul? Yeah, well, we, 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 we found the ring, and now basically I'm just kind of uh, looking to see you know, some accoutrements for, for ringdom, just looking for the, for the bling. We haven't, we haven't talked about this yet. This is, very, this is getting very popular in the gay community, and I can see why. It's that blue tungsten look. Nice ring. Nothing, nothing needed to ornament this. It's just very, very special. Looks good on the finger, looks good on anybody, really. And it's, it's a fashion statement, too. That blue is piercing. You can't help but not gaze into that. And I thought that would be something that you all would be interested in. It's fairly, fairly inexpensive, but it, it looks very, very nice. And like I say, it's becoming more and more fashionable as a gay commitment ring in that cobalt blue. I want to show you that. And uh, again, along the lines of, I mean, that you can't pass this up to such a good value. Uh, I found several others that are worthy of our consideration. This is stainless, stainless, but it's a, it's simulated uh, white gold, with um, with a sapphire in it. Very masculine. Very uh, nice accessory as for dress up, or you know, great with it as as a jeans. Yeah, jeans and uh, final shirt ring for the fall. It's really nice. I secured that through Amazon and not really, you know, not not too pricey. Definitely not a not a budget buster. And I know because I got the bill tonight for everything. So I thought that I would show you that. And I have a couple of others that I think they can. Oh, yeah, stay here. I'm gonna deal with the with the, uh, the bags and such. But look at this. This beautiful emerald simulated ring. It's gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. It's just, it's so clear. Very, very fine. Uh, Sir Kipic Zirconia in a, in a lovely 14-karat uh, gold-plated ring. Excellent. And it gives you a really nice look for, again, for a party. That, that shines so beautifully. Um, you know, under, under night lighting, the kind of lighting you might find in a club, it'll really sparkle. It's all around the ring, yeah. Very, very pretty. And again, available in most sizes. Check it out on Amazon. This was another ring that I had thought would be a real, real nice one for, you know, for a commitment ring. It's, it's etched, so it really does have that three-dimensional look to it that you can't always find. It's a fine looking silver platinum and platinum and, and 14 karat plated gold. Very, very nice. Yeah. Well, that's just very attractive. Anybody would look good at them. Anybody, any man would be happy to have him on his arm with that ring on, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, just thought I'd give you that little choice too. And one more word before we go. Because I tell you what, this is habit for me. 
because it happens to be in my birthstone. It was the same that I just showed you in the Emerald Aquamarine for March. How about that? That's something gorgeous, gorgeous ring. The stones are expertly cut. The, the triple layering of the 14 karat gold plate is it's, it's beautiful. It's flawless, absolutely flawless. Of course, you know everything's coming from, from Shanghai, but they, they always were a, a great uh, jewelry center. I mean, this is not costume jewelry. This is definitely a big deal. And I just thought I would sh show those to you. You can throw them in there on a, on a, um, you know, on your opinion polls. I'd like you to, uh, you know, to say which ones of these that you like and don't like. Cause I'm, I'm thinking of having one giveaway for our three thousandth subscriber, and it will be the ring of your choice. It's coming up. We're only about a, about two less than 200 away so think about that so I, I only have a few sizes for smaller fingers but you know this works as a pinky ring very well and that's that will fit almost everybody yeah so I just wanted to share that with you listen guys I thank you for your subscriptions I thank you for your support we're just beginning to fly here I am stoked your awesomeness is recognized. We're not going anywhere other than up. And uh, YouTube and, and, and living happily gay is sort of in a harmonious mode right now. We know what they want. They know what I want. And uh, I think it'll be a good team. And we want you we love you, we need you, there's no one we'd rather work for but with you, to entertain, to hold your hand when you need it, to comfort and to share the good news that you would find enlightening. We love you, we love you. And you don't have to be living happily gay To have a way to enjoy this beautiful day We're Paul and Brad, the team that's always giving more to you Well, we love you, you're beautiful You're the people that make our hearts sing You're everything, you're everything to me To Brad and we want to be your friends and family forever yes forever you're our friends you are friends good night rainbow crew we love you don't you forget it <laughs>